What's up guys? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Olivia Ostrom and in today's video we are doing another Buff Bunny Collection try on haul. This is for the Sugar Rush Collection that is launching on May 14th at 1pm Central Time, 12pm Mountain Standard Time and of course I'll put all the rest of the time zones on the screen here. I'm so excited for this collection though because it's a very special one. It is a collaboration with Miss Felicia and she absolutely nailed this launch. I first off love the sugar theme because I'm a sugar fiend myself. I love my sweets. I have such a sweet tooth. I literally just went downstairs and grabbed a little handful of gummy bears before filming this video. So that just shows that this is my kind of collection. Um, but the colors in this collection, the styles, the um, like different kinds of uh, patterns are so beautiful. I'm going to put them up on the screen here because you need to see them all together. You can mix and match so many of the options. And sometimes I honestly don't know how I'm going to feel until like I receive the pieces. Us athletes do receive uh, a PDF before we actually get our pieces so we can see what's launching. And sometimes I'm always like, ah, I don't know. Like sometimes I like pieces more once I've tried them on. Sometimes I like them less. And let me tell you, I'm really excited about this launch. There's so many great pieces launching. Anyway, if you choose to support me while shopping, you can use my code Olivia at checkout. Thank you so much for your support. It means the absolute world to me and my family. Um, I do receive a little bit of commission from um, your order and it just means a lot. And my way of giving back to you is to do a monthly giveaway. So every month I choose five winners to receive either a Buff Money collection or an Alani new gift card, whatever you choose. Um, and that's my way of saying thank you. So make sure you enter my monthly giveaway because I know there's so many people who support me and don't enter it and there's such a good chance that you'll win. So anyway, let's go ahead and dive into this video. I'd love to know as we kind of move through this video if you guys prefer that I dive into even more detail than what I go into or if you like the amount of detail that I go into or if you'd prefer if I even kept it even like shorter and sweeter. <laughs> um, so let me know like what your overall thoughts are on these videos and I just want to keep creating content that's helpful for you. So Let's get started. The first piece that I wanna share with you is one sports bra that I was probably most excited about that is launching and for a variety of different reasons. It's different from like anything that we've seen from Buff Bunny Collection before and it's in New Bray, so that's a win. Um, but this is the Candy Wrap Sports Bra. It is absolutely beautiful. I love that it's a v-neck sports bra. I love the cinching on the front um, and that it still does go like a little bit longer. It gives you a little bit more coverage. Not as much as the Revolution bra or the Monarch bra, but it still goes a little bit longer. It doesn't cut you off right after your boobs. Love the gold class. I thought that that's just like such like a pretty detail that they added on there. And when we flip this bra around, the back of the sports bra just has really pretty detailing. So it has these thicker straps that go over your lats, over your shoulders, and then it also has the same strappy detail in the back, which is crisscrossed. The design on this sports bra is just so pretty. It is so flattering, and it's definitely more of like a supportive bra. I found as soon as I put this one on, I felt super just held in. I loved the way that like my boobs were supported. Um, it was a little bit more like compressive than like some bras that I've tried before from Buff Bunny Collection. And the straps are adjustable, which makes it that much better because then you can literally make it so it fits you perfect. There's nothing worse than when a strap like this is just cutting you in at your lats. I know for me, like I've tried so many different sports bras and the ones I never wear are the ones that cut me in at my lats and make me feel like my shoulder is going to detach from my body. I just think it's so uncomfortable. So I am so pleased to see that this one is adjustable. Just something to note is that I'm not wearing the pads in this bra. I usually do wear pads, but sometimes the way that the, um, like the sports bras are packaged in the like Buff Bunny Collection packages, just when they lay flat, they do get a little bit crinkled. And so this will flatten out over time, it's no issue, but I just wanted to let you know that when I tried on this sports bra, I didn't have padding in, but you can take the padding in or out so you can make it work for you. This beautiful sports bra is launching in seven different colors and I would say that it is definitely one of my favorite pieces launching. One of my girlfriends, Gabs, she is definitely more on the chestier side than myself. I believe she's a 34 or 36 um, double D 
and she found this bra to be really really great for her so if you are a little bit bustier this is a really great option and I think that even like on smaller chest size it looks really good too so love 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 this piece buff bunny felicia you nailed it my second question for feedback from my ladies who watch my buff bunny collection reviews you guys prefer that i do like all the sports bras and then all the leggings and then like all the shorts like in separate categories or do you like when i pair outfits together let me know what you prefer and i will do that in the next video 100 percent and i will not ask for any more feedback within this video Okay, thank you. Next piece is the Legacy Leggings, my number one favorite legging. And it is in the most beautiful print. I love this swirl print. This is a brand new print to Buff Bunny collection. And they just did such a great job with it. It's not like tie dye, because I feel like tie dye has kind of been in and it's kind of like maybe going out. Um, it's definitely more like a watercolor print. And I just think that it is so freaking beautiful. Not to mention the color of this, the beige and the white. I was like, this is this is like the perfect nude and um, these would be like really awesome too if you you know sweat a little bit and you don't like to show a lot of sweat like obviously patterns help hide that a little bit more but like just the way like that these like the watercolor is kind of like done on them I feel like you wouldn't even like see any sweat and so what if anyone sees sweat right you know it happens we all get the sweaty butt sweaty boobs it all it happens to all of us right um, but absolutely love these leggings so I am wearing pretty much all these pieces in a size medium I am 35 weeks pregnant um, so five more weeks to go so I obviously have a big bump on me right now um, but these leggings fit me great I typically wear a size small in all leggings in Buff Bunny collection I typically wear a medium in everything else however I've sized up to a medium in all leggings and they're fitting me really comfortably at this point in my pregnancy so I'm so happy with that but these leggings are a 26 inch inseam. They are quite simple on the side. They just have one single seam that comes down the side and then it splits into two. And then the legacy leggings are known for the little butterfly detailing on the back. If you are looking for just like a good staple legging, I cannot recommend these leggings enough. They will not disappoint you. If you would like this like swirl print as well, they also have it coming in rainwater swirl print as well as green swirl print too. And then it's also coming in three solid colors, but I'll pop all the colors up on the screen here. So the Siren leggings have made a comeback. These are leggings from a previous launch, but I just wanted to show you what they look like on just to kind of give you a better idea. And they are back. I remember Felicia saying that they were like one of her faves. So I'm not surprised that she brought them back in her collection. Um, they have the crossover like waistband in the front and then they're very simple leggings down the side no seams at all 26 inch inseam and then they have the like similar um, detailing on the back as the legacy leggings so I would say these are very 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 similar to the legacy leggings except for they have the crossover waistband in the front I'm currently wearing a small in these in the video and a, a medium would be a much better fit for me right now but as I said these are an older piece to me so they actually aren't coming in this color I'll pop all the colors on the screen here one thing I do want to note with the siren legging um, is that I do find that I had to have to adjust the waistband a little bit more it doesn't necessarily like constantly fall down like while I'm working out while I'm wearing it while I'm moving but it is like one of those leggings where like sometimes like the the waistband will just like fall a little bit and it just isn't like sitting right so I do find myself having to adjust it so if that's something that annoys you I would say maybe like skip the the side siren um, and go for the legacy or the rosa but um, overall I really do like the fit of these siren leggings and I know that the crossover detailing is just super super flattering I feel like it just kind of like really draws great detail to like everyone's waist and I just love the look of it okay while we're on the topic of siren let's chat about the siren short so this is the beautiful rain water swirl color and I love how they tie in like purples and oranges together and it looks so freaking good um so this is the exact same waistband that i just showed you from the siren leggings but obviously this is the shorts this is a four inch inseam it has the crossover waistband on the front the legacy detailing on the back and let me just say I didn't think I was going to love these on my pregnant body and 
I actually am so happy with them. I know I'm gonna love them even more like when I'm not pregnant just because obviously like this isn't maternity wear and sizing up definitely helps with having a bump but everything just kind of fits a little bit different when you have a bump and so I am excited to wear these like in my postpartum journey and also the fact that I've sized up in a lot of these pieces is great because then I'm not gonna you know feel like I'm having to squish into my active wear that just doesn't fit me um so yeah anyway I absolutely love these shorts I love the swirl print again it's really great if you do just prefer like a pattern or if you are wanting to hide a little bit of sweat one thing to note with the swirl print is that it is printed on white so when I do squat in the leggings I don't find that it like shows through white but I will say that it gets like a little bit lighter in color so obviously like the color like this is um, more vibrant and then just as you like stretch it out it gets a little bit more white but definitely not see-through or anything like that at all okay monarch bra is back and for good reason everyone literally loves it um, I am so freaking obsessed with this color this is the brand new peach rings color but the monarch bra is coming in 11 different colors so if you love the monarch bra and you want some different colors you want some new variety you got lots of different options and I love it because this bra is just so amazing so I won't go too far into detail because we've talked about this lots but obviously it's the v-neck in the front longer line sports bra a little bit thicker of straps coming up the top um, but then it um, splits into like three spaghetti straps on the back and I feel like this bra is just like known for the beautiful detailing on the back I love how this just like I just find it like so flattering. I like that it kind of like hugs you like right here too. I know that, you know, a lot of people hold a little bit more like body fat percentage there. And especially with me gaining weight during pregnancy, like I just really love the way that the Monarch bra like holds me in and fits me. So I wear a size medium in all bras right now. I will say that I find that um, my boobs have grown a lot. So I'm probably like a 36 like C maybe even like a D, probably a C, like a full C cup. Um, that's how much my boobs have grown. Um, and the medium still fits me great from when I was like a 34B. 34C, 34B, probably 34B. But you honestly can't go wrong with the Monarch bra. I really do love it. Um, the only thing is, is that some ladies who do have a lot larger of a chest do find that this just doesn't give them the support that they need and that there is like a little bit too much cleavage in it. Um, I would say that this is more on the light to medium compression side where the Candy Wrap Sports bra is definitely more on the medium compression side and like there's just more coverage in that bra as well. So depending on what you're looking for, for, um, but I am obsessed with this peach ring color and I think that this color is going to fly very quickly. Also, I should just quickly mention how freaking good these this set looks together. I love, love, love that with the swirl print, you can tie in so many different colors. Like you can tie in rainwater blue, you can tie in white, you can tie in peach rings, like so many options look so good with this. Um, I also did get the Monarch bra in the rainwater color as well. Um, so that's the exact same sports bra, but I just wanted to show you guys what it looks like on again I love it so much they just killed this swirl print and I'm obsessed with it there is some glitter coming back a part of this collection and um, we have the maraschino sports bra coming back it's been a while since that one has we've seen it probably like a year now and um, it's coming back with some glitter so I will pop pictures on the screen here I didn't receive any of the glitter pieces but I wanted to show you what the maraschino bra looks like on so just so I can give you an idea of like how it fits me um, I will say that there have been some changes made from the like this version of the maraschino bra that I'm wearing it is now in the Elysium fabric and it now fits more true to size so just stick with your true size if you are planning on snagging this sports bra and um, if you do like the glitter please 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 make sure you care for your leggings honestly anytime you're washing your activewear you should really be washing it on delicate on cold washing things inside out can be helpful but especially with the glitter like leggings and sports bras that I'll be talking or leggings that I'll be talking about in a second just make sure that you're washing them inside out just so that you're not um, losing any of like the glitter pieces on it 
like the quality of buffony stuff is really great though so it shouldn't be an issue and i do have some glitter pieces from a while a while ago i forget what that, those were called but like they have still held up great so the maraschino sports bra has like more like dense glitter on the bottom and then it kind of lightens as it moves up the sports bra and then they have the uh dazzle leggings so the dazzle leggings are also in the elysium fabric they're launching in the same three colors so the rain water silver the black silver and the white silver so again it's that ombre look the ombre starts at the bottom of the leggings and then moves up the leggings the leggings are a 26 inch inseam too so if you're looking for more like performance leggings those would be an awesome pick they do have another like kind of performance style legging that I will chat about in a second as well so the other more performance fabric is the twilight legging it kind of has like a subtle like glittery um, detail to it it only comes in the color black and the like glitter on it is very very subtle like you definitely see it if you're up close but from far away it would look more like a black set um so the fabric is a nylon and spandex it spandex it is a light to medium compression and similar to the um dazzle leggings it has like a very similar fit to the rebel leggings that have launched again and again um so just if you're wondering like how do these leggings fit what do they kind of look like they're very similar to the rebel legging um so if you want some like more performance kind of like material feels and you want a little bit of the dazzle but not too much dazzle then like the twilights it is kind of like in the middle of the dazzle versus no glitter at all to go along with the twilight legging there is the twilight sports bra which does look quite similar to the rosa sports bra however it is a little bit different i'd say the back looks very similar but the front looks a little bit different the rosa sports bra on the front um swoops down into like a just a regular U, just a regular swoop neckline. Um, but the Twilight Sports Bra has more of like a sweetheart neckline. So again, it's the same fabric. So it's very light, subtle, like sparkle detailing. And it is in the same nylon spandex material. Um, Buffany Collection says that this is more of like a light to medium compression. So I would say that it probably fits similar to the Rosa Sports Bra. If anything I'd say it maybe might be a little bit more on like the lighter side. Next piece I want to chat about is the one that I'm wearing. This is the Synergy Long Sleeve Crop and this is a must-have piece. I feel like Buff Bunny Collection hasn't come out with like many like full length um long sleeves like this and i am so happy with it i love it so the blend of this top is a nylon spandex polyester blend and it is so soft and comfortable it kind of reminds me of like the lululemon like the fit of it kind of reminds me of like the lululemon like long sleeves or short sleeves i should know what they're called they've had them for forever they have like the lululemon like sign on them but like this is like even like softer and like way more comfortable and I freaking love it. Um, it's very different from the Eco line that just recently launched, um, a part of the Most Wanted. Um, I find this to be like a lot softer, a lot more thin, um, like more stretchy where the Eco line was like very compressive and like more of like a thicker material. So I love this so much i think i need to get it in black at least if not maybe another color as well um so obviously it has long sleeves it has the little thumb hole in the sleeves too which is great if you do want to use it if not it's there um and then it is obviously a regular crew neckline and it is full length so i could definitely see myself like cropping it a little bit rolling it into my sports bra and like wearing it like that but i love 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 that it's full length so if you want a bit more coverage or you don't want your stomach showing like you have that option too and it goes nice and long as well on both the arms and on the like and the length of the shirt sometimes shirts like because I'm 5'8 they just don't fit right they like still are a little bit cropped even though they're supposed to be long um and this is just like perfect on so many levels it has the beautiful cut out hole in the back which is so cute that way you can see a little bit of like a pop of your sports bra or if you just like need to like breathe a little bit if you're working out and you just want a little bit more ventilation that's there too i would love 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 to see this come back out without the like hole in the back i think that it's a beautiful detail but i think sometimes it's nice to just like have the option of also just having like full coverage too so 
I hope that this comes back in like t-shirts, in tank tops, in all of the things because I just feel like it's so great. So it does come in five different colors. This is in the color donut worry, like donut but don't worry, I love that, so cute. It is literally the most perfect nude color though. I feel like nailing nude is difficult and a lot of times it's like, I like what they were going for but it's not perfect and I feel like this is just the most perfect, beautiful nude and I think it looks so great on like every skin tone and I just absolutely love it. Like they nailed this color and I also have some more Donut Worry. This is the brand new Lifesaver shorts. So these are the new loose shorts. Um, if you liked the flow shorts, you'll probably really like these shorts. They are a little bit different though. So um, here we are. These are what the shorts look like. They have the drawstring on the front. The top of the waistband is very similar to the flow shorts. However, they're a little bit shorter in length. So these are a two inch inseam. So I definitely find them to be a bit shorter on the front and back but definitely on the side so it has this little like peekaboo cut out where the two pieces of material like kind of like scallop together and then obviously there is the liner underneath the shorts so these are so cute I wish they were a tiny bit longer which is usually like my thing with short shorts um, but I will definitely be wearing these lots in the summer it was hard for me to envision what they would look like on like my body um, with without being pregnant but I've seen them on like so many different other like models and athletes I'll put lots of pictures on the screen here so you can see what they look like and um, just because obviously like something that's a little bit more flowy is going to look a lot different when you have a belly versus when you don't but overall really happy with these shorts they do have the two inch inseam the spandex on these shorts is different than the flow shorts so they're a little bit more like compressive a little bit more true to a spandex material not as compressive as the succulent skirt though or squirt so if you have tried the succulent those ones are quite compressive these ones I'd say are like in between um, another thing to note is that there is a pocket in these leggings too so there's no like pockets in the flowy part of like the front or the back where the flow shorts there are however there is a pocket in the side of the spandex here so if you do just need a little place to store your keys or your phone or something um, I love that you just have the option to use this and otherwise it's you don't even really notice that it's there it's just kind of like tucked away and hidden um so I am wearing a size medium in these shorts I would say that these shorts fit very similar to the flow short version 2 that launched a part of the swim collection so the most recent um flow short that launched and it's the same soft material as like the marble um as the like flow shorts that launched a part of the swim um so it's definitely more of like the softer kind of feel compared to the I don't even know what you would call that like more of like swim like rougher kind of material so really really happy with these shorts if you don't love short shorts I would maybe stay away from these the flow shorts definitely offer a little bit more coverage but if you like your short shorts and you want to you know show off the sides of your legs a little bit more these are so cute and they're also coming in a bunch of different colors eight different colors okay the next outfit that I'm going to share with you is a chillin outfit this is brand new to Buff Bunny Collection and very excited about this outfit super super comfortable um so let's start with the crop top so this is the confection crop top so here it is uh, it is definitely a higher necked tank top um and it is cropped in the front but it is super cropped on the sides so it's definitely a very deep swoop um in the front and then it's also a very deep swoop in the back a little bit more full coverage on the back and then of course it um, cuts up on the side so it's kind of that same like scalloped kind of look similar to the lifesaver shorts that I just shared with you but this is in the Nimbus material it is so soft if you've tried Nimbus before you know how just like comfy it is I would say it's less of like a workout material and more so just like a chillin comfy kind of outfit I think you could definitely get away with working out in this I could see myself wearing this to work out especially like postpartum um but I would say that this is more meant to be more of like a lounge like lifestyle kind of piece so one feature that they added into this sports bra which I love is that they added in a shelf bra so if you lift up the front piece here you can see that there is a shelf bra in there there's no like actual cups or pads 
or seams or anything in there, but it just allows like an extra piece of fabric so that you don't have to wear a bra, which I love because if I can not wear a bra, I will not wear a bra. So I really do like this crop and it's just so cute. I love that you can wear a sports bra under it if you want to or a regular bra, whatever floats your boat, but you don't have to. Um, other things about this is that it does cut up quite high on the side. So if you like prefer, you know, or if you don't prefer your side showing, then I would just say stay away from this one because it definitely cuts up quite high. Um, but it is just such a cute detail and I still feel like it gives like good coverage on the front and on the back as well so I'm wearing a size medium in this it is coming in two other colors rain water blue as well as sugar plum to go along with it we have the good old snack pant I need to sit cross-legged because my back is starting to really hurt me what am I sitting on is something wet oh I was like what am I sitting on I literally have a fit shake behind my butt I literally thought I was like did I pee myself you know at this point in pregnancy you just never know really um, anyway, these are the snack pants, which are also in the Nimbus fabric. Um, this is, again, so different than anything that Buff Bunny has ever done, so it's nice to see some more like lifestyle kind of pieces. I hope we continue to see more and more lifestyle pieces, um, but love the fit of these around the top. They have a little bit more of like a thicker waistband at the top. They have the drawstring. They have pockets on both sides, and the pockets are really nice and deep. Like You can put your phone in there, and you do not have to worry about it falling out. These are definitely more of like a pant kind of style. I would say they're like straight leg um so they do like kind of flare out like a little bit at the bottom but when they're like on you they just kind of like fall straight down um i am 5'8 and i did find these to be a little bit short on me i'd say they were like about an inch and a half too short so i think if you're like 5'7 five, 5'6 five, like these are gonna be the perfect length for you obviously if you're on the shorter side it might be you know something where you might want to look into getting them hemmed or just wearing them like a little bit longer for me unfortunately being 5'8 um pants are hard like sometimes like or if you're on the shorter side like pants are hard right I do wish there was like the option to like cinch them in like I was thinking similar to the Odyssey pants that launched a part of the swim collection there was like a little like um elastic that you could cinch and I was like these would be like like I feel like almost even like more elevated if you had that option to cinch them in. But um, just one thing that I wanted to note for my taller ladies as well as for my shorter ladies, um, if you're wondering about like what the length is on them. The snack pant is coming in the same colors as the confection um, crop. They are kind of meant to be worn together, but obviously you can mix and match too. So it comes in the rainwater blue as well as the sugar plum. They do have the untamed hoodie as well as the untamed sweats coming back. I wanted to pull mine out from the mad scientist collection because that is what these fit most similar to i know that the untamed has kind of like changed sizing a little bit um, but this fit is 100 percent cotton it is very similar to the mad scientist launch i wore a small from the mad scientist launch so i, I can't fit into them right now so i I don't have any video footage of me trying them on um, for you, but I'll put lots of pictures on the screen here. Um, these untamed sets have been back many times before. I would say just stay true to size. Currently in the untamed sets, I am a size medium. So medium fits me great. I just didn't have any from the Mad Scientist launch that were 100% cotton in a size medium to show you guys. And the small just like wouldn't even get over my thighs. So um, I really, really love the untamed sets. If you're looking for something that is like, like a little bit cozier, um, more of like a sweat set kind of vibe with more coverage. Obviously a hoodie is way more coverage than a crop top. Um, then definitely check that out. It is just coming in the one color, which is rain water blue, but it is so beautiful. Let me show you what the rain water blue looks like. It's this beautiful, beautiful blue color. Will it focus? The sun is starting to shine in on me. There we go. That's what it looks like. Legacy shorts are coming back in nine different colors. This is an older pair that launched. So they are coming out in this color, but they are coming out in the rain water. This was business blue. That's what color this is. And this is the rain water blue. So as you can tell, like that's the difference between the two. Um, these are an older pair, but they are the exact same short. So they're the four inch inseam, simple on the front, no front seam, and then legacy detailing on the back. They are coming out 
out in nine different colors. So if you love the legacy leggings but you want some shorts, um, these are an awesome option. I do wish that we were seeing more like biker shorts in this collection because I tend to lean more towards biker shorts um, for workouts and for day-to-day -day life than like short shorts, but if you're a big fan of short shorts, then we got lots of those a part of this collection. Okay, let's chat about the Rosa pocket legging. In the last video that I filmed where, I think it was the last launch, most wanted launch, there was Rosa pocket leggings and I couldn't find any Rosa pocket leggings. So I'm so happy that I got my hands on some because I am happy with these. This is the Rosa pocket leggings. So they are the exact same as the Rosa leggings. Super, super simple kind of legging. However, these bad boys have the pocket down the side. They are a 26 inch inseam and then the detailing on the back is just very very simple it has the booty contour and that is all this is in the black terrazzo they also have the blue terrazzo too but i really love the colors that they incorporated into this so as you can tell there's white there's the donut worry color and then obviously there's black but like you could easily wear this with like grays you could wear this with so many different colors um and so i really really like the ter ter terrazzo color. Why can't I say that? Um, it just it feels really different from any pattern that Buff Bunny Collection has come out with before. But it is coming out in six different colors too, so if you prefer a solid color, you definitely have that option as well. Rainforest Crop is back. So happy to see it. Very happy to see it. I actually already had this one in the color black, but I'm not mad about it because I'll be honest and say that I wear black on top the most. Even if I'm wearing like colored leggings to the gym and I'm like, I want to throw on a crop or I want to throw on something on top of my sports bra, I'm like always pulling for something black. So I'm like very excited. Um, this is uh, relaunching again. This came out a part of the Bloom collection, I believe, and it is a simple crop on the front, definitely more of like a flowy kind of material. It is in the Nimbus fabric as well, so it's really, really soft. I love the length of this crop. I love how long the sleeves are and the detailing on the back is just so pretty. There's the like cut out at the top and then it kind of tapers down into that little knot on the bottom. And I wear this so often while pregnant. It's probably like one of my most pulled like crop pieces because again, it's not too cropped and it still covers my stomach, which I freaking love in this season of life. Um, and so it is coming in four different colors. It's coming in black, ivory, rainwater blue, as well as the sugar plum. I'll also put a picture of one of the models wearing it on the screen. You can wear it backwards too. So lots of Lots of options. Okay, we also have a seamless sports bra launching. It is the Synergy Seamless Sports Bra. It is launching in an ombre color. So we have the Rainwater Ombre, we have the Sugar Plum Ombre, as well as the Green Ombre. It is a nylon polyester spandex material, and it's definitely more on like the light to compressive, or light, light compression side. So um, the ombre starts a little bit darker on the bottom and it lightens as it goes up. It is more of kind of like a square neckline in the front. And then on the back, it has like a very pretty knot detail and the straps go like directly down. So very cute option if you're looking for something a little bit more ombre -ed. Um I like that with the ombre, you can pair it with so many different colors too. Cause obviously the way that the color changes through the sports bra, like there's so many different options and things that you can pair it with and probably things in your closet that you could pair it with as well. We also have the taffy tank that is launching. This is a simple tank top on the front. It doesn't go super high, but it also isn't like super, super low. I'd say it's more like mid coverage um, on the front. It is more of a relaxed fit. It is in the Nimbus fabric. And then it has a pretty like keyhole kind of cut out on the back with a little knot detail as well. I'll pop more pictures on the screen here. So if you want something that's looser and has more coverage compared to compared to the confection crop, um, this would be a great option because it is also in the Nimbus fabric. And this is coming in black, rainwater blue, as well as sugar plum. And so I'm literally just sitting here editing my video and I realized that I completely forgot to talk about the sugar coat jacket that is launching. It is very, very similar to the Phantom jacket that has launched in the past. The front looks really similar. It has a little bit of a collar on it. It is the nylon spandex blend. Um, um, however, it has a beautiful like cut out detail on the back with
with some crisscrossing like fabric. I'll post a picture of it here, but this piece looks incredible. If you love like the um, Buff Bunny Collection zip up jackets, or if you loved the Phantom jacket, I feel like you'll absolutely love this one. I wish I would have snagged this one so I could have tried it on for you guys because it's definitely a piece that I'm really excited about. I wear my zip up jackets from Buff Bunny all the time, but I can't believe I forgot to mention that piece in the video. Um, I will post all the colors that is coming in on the screen here as well, um, but back to the video. And then last but not least, we have scrunchies launching in nine different colors. Awesome. These scrunchies are just so great. They're such high quality and they're really, really comfortable. But that is everything that is launching a part of the Sugar Rush collection. If you choose to support me while shopping, you can use my code Olivia at checkout. Please make sure you enter my monthly giveaway so I can give back to you. If you have any questions on any of the pieces, sizing, colors, you want me to help you pick out some options that are best for you, send me a message on Instagram or you can always comment in the comment box down below. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it and I will catch you in the next one. Bye!